Just drive all the way to the rainbow's end. Just drive, and we'll never turn our backs again. Just drive. With the increasing number of electric vans being sold around the world, it was natural for many of them to start being used as campers. Most of them can't be called a complete RV though, as they usually are not equipped with a toilet and a shower, or they're not even being used or sold commercially. This for example is Juicy New Zealand's first electric camper van. Well, I was pleasantly surprised while researching my RV rental for New Zealand that there are fully self-contained RVs being commercially used right now. Introducing the Brits EV RV, built on the Chinese EV80 platform. It is available now for rental out of Christchurch and Auckland. It is fully self-contained and 100% electric. It features a refrigerator freezer, toilet, shower, and an electric induction cooktop. Original specifications gave this unit a 200 kilometer range, but after RV conversion, range has been reduced to 120 kilometers due to weight and additional drag. For you non-metric Americans, that means around 75 miles under ideal conditions, which is sadly one of the reasons that this unit was not for me. 120 kilometers is just not enough, and that's what people are writing in the comment section right now, I promise you. Even with the reduced distances in New Zealand, a simple 643 kilometer trip between Auckland and Wellington will require at least six recharges, wasting precious time of my vacation. This is primarily a rental RV for granola crunchers with all the time in the world who wish to travel mostly on a carefully curated trip based on charging stations. But it is a nice little unit and fit and finish looks quite crisp. Further issues I've discovered is that the microwave induction cooktop and heater do not work via an inverter while boondocking, or freedom camping as they call it in the land of the Kiwi. You must plug into shore power for these items to work. Clearly, this needs to be addressed in any future models. And did I mention it only sleeps too? And this vehicle does not have child restraint equipment, so it is also not suitable for a couple with a small child. But it is a beautiful first attempt at the world's first 100% electric RV and it is available now for rental in New Zealand. This is an early concept, this is an early design, it's going to get better with time.